Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Assassin's Creed 2. I think we're going to continue on with the main story a little bit longer, just because I want to open up Venice more. And then uh, we'll see how things go from there. So let us fast travel to Venice. Uh, where's the guy? Oh, he's up here. All right. There's six fast travel points in Venice? That's interesting. And this definitely shows, uh, how much of the city we have it. What about the other cities, like Florence? Oh, so there's half of Florence we haven't unlocked. That's where all these extra towers are coming from. Okay, Romaga Flori. Okay, well, we got those. So Venice, neither Venice nor Florence are fully unlocked. That's interesting. Okay. Um, We'll start in the center and work our way to wherever the uh, the main quest is. All right. So our mission up uh, should have taken the uh, southern point, I guess. Oh well. After the recent campaign in defense of the Republic's foreign interests, a levy will be imposed upon all importation of goods deemed non-essential. That's well, interesting. Taxing people because to fund their wars. Stop! Stay back! Stop! With you. All right, so that's a Templar uh, courier taken out. Really, I got notoriety for that. All right. Uh, I see there is a crate here. Get up there. Yes, it is. I hear. I hear the glow <laughs> for all the sense that makes. That. Oh no, that's a wanted poster. Okay. And you shouldn't be alive, but here we are. Oh, I was gonna. Ow! I was gonna knock him off, but. There we go. And no crime was committed because no one was around to see it. <laughs> All right. Oh, here it is. Whee! Uh, we can leave the poster up for now. Now, before I get even more distracted, let's, uh, let's head over to, okay, I guess we gotta cross here. Uh, let's head this way. Oh, they might have hooks. Okay, they do have hooks on the, uh, but that's, oh, well, there is a chest here, so I guess we'll just kill these guys. Wow, they are uh, not very good at their job. Oh. Okay, I put the guard down. <laughs> wow. That is some uh, grade A guarding right there. All right. Do you have anything? Nope. Nope. Alright, so we'll just get repairs at the blacksmith and then we'll do the mission. There we go. Alright. What is Emilio? I told him to be here. You told him yourself? In person? 
Yes, myself, in person. I'm concerned that you don't trust me. As am I. Perhaps you'll arrive with the others. Walk with me. Birds of a feather. They hailed the Templars to eavesdrop on their meeting. So, how go things in the palace? Do you require... Honestly, it's difficult. Mosinigo keeps his circle close. I have tried to lay the groundwork, making suggestions. But he has other voices at his ears. Then you must work hard. You must become part of his inner circle. See, I understand. But it's harder than I expected. And why is that, Carlo? I don't know. He just... Uh, the Doge doesn't like me. I wonder why. It's not my fault. I keep trying to please him. I learn what he craves and I have it delivered. The finest jams from the orchards of Sardinia. The newest fashions from Milano. Yes, and that's called being a sycophant. A what? What did you call me? A doormat. A flatterer. A bootlicker. Need I go on? Bastardo. You don't know what it's like. You don't understand the pressure in there. Oh, I don't understand pressure. No, you have no idea. You are a government official. I am two steps from the Doge himself. I am beside him day and night. You wish you could be where I am. Are you done? Hardly. You listen to me now. I am close. The Doge can be recruited to our cause. I'm sure of it. I just... I need a little more time. Time is not a thing we have in great supply. It's such a slow day. My feet are killing me. Can't we sit down inside somewhere? Do you know anywhere truly safe to discuss things such as these? Could you All right, well, at least we're in wherever this is. Buongiorno, cousin. Senor Carlo? We thought Emilio would be with you. Emilio is dead. What? How? The assassin. The same one who hunted down the Pazzi. He's here in Venezia. E così? Silvio, did you not know? He could be anywhere. He could be here right now and we might not even know. He struck Emilio inside his own palazzo. And so? What of our plans? There is no longer time for subtlety, my brothers. We must act now. But Marco, I am so close. A few more days, if I can just... No. It happens this week. We should keep moving. What does the Spaniard have to say of this change of plan? You can ask him yourself soon enough. He's here? From Roma? So I've heard. Good. Perhaps he's made a decision. About what, cousin? About which of us shall step into the robes of the dog? I didn't know there was a decision to be made. Surely the choice is obvious to all. Obvious indeed. It should be the one who organized the entire operation. The one who came up with the idea of how to save this city. Go away. There is no Last lack of value in tactical intelligence, good Silvio. But it is wisdom one needs to rule. Do not stink, mother. Take maintenance of the peace. Calma, calma, Amici, please. There's no need for this. You know it's not up to either of you. For all we know, you may not even choose. Oh, come on, seriously? Except somehow I'm not desync from that. Basta! We wait for his arrival. Are you sure he's coming? Get down, Stronzo! Yes! Signore, 
We should move a little faster. I feel eyes on us. Okay, I Thank don't... Thank you, Dante. We will move at your pace. <laughs> this I don't... guard's a good find, cousin. How much did you pay for him? Perhaps not as much as he deserves. He saved my life on two occasions, though he's not much of a conversationalist. Enough with your inane prattle. The choice of Doji was never up to any of you, and you were never given permission to make plans. Forgive us, Maestro. We wish only to serve. The plan is this. Doji Mochenigo will die tonight. And once that it's been done, Marco shall take his place. We ringrazio umilmente, Maestro. <coughs> Good. Messer Grimaldi, you are closest to Mochenico. You work the most vital. Serve us well, and it won't be forgotten. Walk with me. I don't want any blood spilled, you understand? It must appear to all that he goes quietly. Certo, Maestro. When are you closest to him? I have full run of the palace. He may not care to hear what I have to say, but he trusts me by now as one of his own. Bravo. Then I want you to infiltrate the kitchen and poison his meal. So be it. Marco, can you furnish us with a suitable toxin on short notice? I defer to my cousin. That is really his area of expertise. Ah, Silvio. I am at your service, Maestro. What can you bring to get this done? I will confer with my associates in the streets, but chances are good that I can procure some cantarella. Yes, and what is that? It is a most effective form of arsenic and difficult to trace. Ah, va bene, va bene. Then it's decided. I am, now that I have a moment to talk, I am amazed I didn't get desync when we kind of went full aggro. Notice of execution. The merchant Medardo of San Polo has been found guilty of treason against the Serene Republic and will be executed publicly in the Piazza San Marco at first light two days hence. Forgive me, Maestro, but is this not perhaps a tad dangerous for you? Involving yourself so intimately with the minutiae of our plans. I feel the need to involve myself more directly. The Patsy disappointed us in Firenze. I pray you will not do the same. Do not worry this time. The Patsy were a bunch of foolish... The Patsies were a potent and venerable family, reduced to rubble by one young assassin. Do not underestimate this troublesome foe who now haunts your city. For the same fate will befall the Barbarico. I want this done promptly. Bene, I must return to Roma. Time is of the essence. Do not fail us. I should have kept my eyes on them. I need to go and see Antonio if I have any hope of salvaging this mess I've made. I mean, why? You have, uh... <laughs> you have their plans. You know what's going to happen. But, uh... Yeah, what a... It's funny how we just tail them. And, um... 
listen to their plans and thwart their plans that way. Well, we could just assassinate them all when they're in one group like that and also thwart their plans and all future plans and make their organization fall apart. It's always amused me. It's like we're assassins and we could be assassinating these people. But instead we just listen. All right, so let's go see Antonio. Uh... All right, I don't want to deal with you, mister. Oh, I am pretty much there. I just need to uh, scale the walls. All right. There we go. Please. Oh, nope. I was hoping there'd be, like, a door here <laughs> that would let me get to the other side of the palace, but I guess not. All right. Man, that guy takes his job way too seriously. Uh, over here. Good thing his aim is generally pretty poor. Okay. And there we go. Woo! Did not realize the drop was that deep. <laughs> All right. Salute, bello mio. Come stai? You back to see me already? Desolato, mia cara, but I am not here to play. I must speak with Antonio. It's urgent. Antonio! Ezio's here! Ezio, is everything all right? Carlo Grimaldi and the Barbario are in league with the one they call the Spaniard. They're going to murder the Doge and replace him with one of their own. They will have all of Venezia. Their entire fleet in their grasp. And they call me a criminal. Then you'll help me. You have me on your side, brother. And the support of all my men. And women. Grazie, amici. But, Ezio, I must warn you. It's not going to be so easy this time. Palazzo Ducale is the most heavily guarded building in Venezia. Nothing is impenetrable. <laughs> this is why we like you, Ezio. Come, let's go take a look. We'll come up with a plan. All right, if at first you don't succeed, discover a way to infiltrate the Palazzo Ducale. Quick business, let's do it. Terrible. Though, treachery like this no longer surprises me. When I was a child, we were taught that the nobles were just and kind. I believed it. Though my father was only a cobbler, and my mother a scullery maid, I aspired to be much more. I studied hard. I persevered. But the nobles would never have me. If you are not born one of them, acceptance is impossible. So I ask you, Ezio, who are the true nobles of Venezia? Men like Carlo Grimaldi and Marco Babarigo. No! I say we are the thieves and mercenary and whores. While we work to save this city and its people, the nobles seek to make it their plaything. Okay, so I guess he's done talking now. Um, I'd be curious to see how he thinks thieving is saving the city, but okay. I mean, I think I know what they're going for, but still. Uh, Alright, let's see here. We got some bridges here we can use to close the gap. Uh, 
Uh, at least the pe the uh, courtyard is open this time and unguarded. We need to scout the palazzo carefully. See it from every angle. We just might find a way in. I know of a tall campanile behind the palazzo. Or we might find a way to climb the back of the basilica. Do you have any ideas? I assume the front door is out. <laughs> Va bene. We'll try the front door as well, Saputello. All right. Is this going to be... Okay, so these are going to be like the... No, okay. So, what do you think? We're not getting in this way. They'll have time to murder the Doge before we're able to get through all these guards. I thought they were going to make me climb that tower that we climbed before, but... <laughs> Alright, we gotta stay off. Well, that's why this whole area was blocked off, is because it's the Doge's Palace. Or Palazzo. Alright. So, let's climb up here. Ooh, chest. Come on, God. <laughs> oh, these controls can be annoying sometimes. There we go. And up we go. And we have a nice ladder here. There we go. I suppose we gotta wait for Antonio. Look at that. Archers everywhere. And the walls are impossible to climb on this side. Alrighty. Eee. Oh, he actually had. He can't do a leap of faith, so he's got to actually climb down the tower. That's funny. All right. Come on. Now we can tear that down. <laughs> I like how they just magnetized to that haystack. All right. Whee! All right, let's take the bridge. All right. Bene, we're in luck. Looks like there's a perfect path up the scaffolding to the roof of the basilica. Shall we? Oh, good thing there's some construction going on today. Oh, this is the way they want me to go. All right. Oh man, a restricted area. There we go. And we just need Antonio's slow ass to catch. Ezio, look! Isn't that him? Grimaldi! Don't you understand what I'm offering you, Signore? Listen to me, please. Or this will be your last chance. How dare you! I'm sorry. Mi dispiace. I meant nothing by it. I'm only looking out for your safety. We're running out of time. There's no way through this fence, and there are guards everywhere. Diavolo! Follow my lead. It's impossible. 
There's no way in or out for men. Only birds. Yes. Birds. Where are you going now? To see my friend Leonardo. <laughs> All right, I guess uh, we're going to use his flying machine. How oh, fitting, since we just uh, visited his studio in a uh, very good time the other week. Or two or three weeks ago now, I guess, at this point, by the time this video goes up. But... Sorry about that. I've got a doje to save, even though he's an asshole. <laughs> wow, that was, uh, that was, uh, a thing. <laughs> All right. Let's unlock more of this city so we can, uh, collect more codex pages and other things. Because that is the true point of this game, to collect everything. I'm going to hate myself by the time I'm done with the Assassin's Creed series, collecting everything. Oh. Alright. Leonardo! Leonardo! I need your help, Leonardo. Does it work? What? What are you asking? Does it work, Leonardo? Can it really fly? I don't know. It's only a prototype. An idea. It's not ready yet. Have you tried it? No. It's too dangerous. To test it, you'd have to leap off a tower. Who would be mad enough to do a thing like that? Leonardo, I think you just found your madman. Nothing ventured, nothing gained. Test Leonardo's flying machine. So, how does she work? Have you ever watched a bird in flight? It's not about being lighter than air. It's about grace and balance. You must use your body's own weight to control your elevation and direction. Good luck, Ezio. Okay. There we go. Oh, that's a desync. Why am I crashing? This is ridiculous. The palazzo's too far away. Diablo, I give up. I'm gonna end up killing myself before I ever kill another Templar. Water landing. <laughs> I can't believe it! It worked! It really worked! You flew, Ezio! You flew! See, but not very far. Well, what were you expecting? The machine wasn't designed for distance. All right, look, let me go over my plans here. Maybe I can find some way to extend the duration of the flight. Ezio, my men tell me Carlo has the poison. We must hurry. Antonio, this is Leonardo, the master inventor who built this... this pezzo di merda. Hey, it's not the machine's fault. It's mine. Checked and rechecked my blueprints. It's just impossible. I don't know how to extend the flight. Da che idea del cazzo? Eureka! Of course! <laughs> Genio! What is he doing now? It rises. It needs fire. It air under its wings will lift the machine. Leonardo, what good is one fire going to do? Not one fire, Ezio. A dozen, built all across the city. Enough to carry you from here all the way to the Palazzo Ducale. How? Ah, oh, capisco. My men could do that, but you are forgetting about the guards. Don't worry, I will take care of them. I'll give the order to have my men move in behind you, and hold the locations. They'll light them all up the second the sun goes down over San Marco. Well begun is half done. Take care of the guards so Antonio and his men can light the fires needed to provide lift for the flying machine. I mean, it's not a terrible idea. Wait, I thought we needed a dozen fires. Why are we only clearing out four areas? 
<laughs> Howdy, boys. Oh, let's get out of here. What? Why did I get notoriety for that? No one saw that. All right. Let us advance to the next areas. Uh, yeah, we're going to have to swim. Thank God we can actually swim. This game would be really annoying if uh, you couldn't swim in the cities. Oh, what, the ship is... They're going to set fire to the ship. A shipment from China. Some kind of colored powder they brought over for a big party. Really expensive. You ask me, where these nobles spend their money? So they brought gunpowder from China for fireworks. Interesting. Come on. Oh, motherfucker. There we go. That uh, almost didn't go as planned. But hey, we could use some of this powder. Unfortunately, all we get is money. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, fuck. All right. How unfortunate for you gentlemen that you caught me. If only you had mind your own business. Uh, I see only one person uh, is left to stand against me. There we go. <laughs> At least those other guards had a good sense of self-preservation. Alright. Uh, we gotta go up. Okay, now this one makes sense since those guards ran away. Why do you fall off? Okay, so they are all oh, they must be rooftop archers. Okay. Okay, okay. Hey. <laughs> Good thing we don't have to be stealthy for this. Which way did he go? Bam! Put that dog down! Ouch, kibibbles. That's got hurt. Alright. And hopefully we can just fast travel across the roofs to the last couple locations. Oh, this guy's... Uh, one of the guards is on the roof. <laughs> Ow! Ow, that hurt. Turn around. There is nothing here for you. Alright. Good thing, uh... The guards of a water city can't swim. This is just bullying. Alright. Oh, 
I can fix that for you guys. Sorry, your self-preservation efforts kicked in too late. There we go. Do you have medicine on you? Anyone got medicine on them? No? No medicines? Ah, there we go. Alright. Well, that'll save me, like, 50 florins. <laughs> Hey, how's it going? Well, we gun is half done, suit. There we go. Trying to think. Okay, so he's the guy I bribe. So this might be the corrupt official we can assassinate. Because I do... I'm... Fine. Oh yeah, he is one of the uh, people we can assassinate. Excellent. Nope, I don't want to climb. There we go, we're anonymous. Let's go to the blacksmith and repair our armor. Except I have to get out of this infernal courtyard first. <laughs> uh, here we go. There we go. Hey, sir, I need repairs. And a f mostly free heal. And starting the mission should heal me the rest of the way, so. I don't know what actually is the threshold for when um, armor breaks. Because I don't think I've actually had any armor break. It's gotten damaged. I know when it breaks, we lose max health, basically. But it seems to have a very generous threshold. But, uh... I guess we'll have to find that out later, maybe. I'm sure if I go through, like, all my medicine in a single fight, that would probably be enough to break it, but hopefully that never happens. Alright, let's get back to Da Vinci here. Oh, ah, ba -ba -ba -ba. Okay. Sorry about that, people. I'm just in a rush. Ezio has no chill. Alright. Let's have no notoriety before we uh, invade the palace, as it were. Alright. Uh, staircase, yay. All right. Uh, do, 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 do. Woo. No, I don't want to find the staircase. We're so close. I will say I do like the day-night cycle, even if right now it's um like fixed based on the mission you are doing. I know by the time of AC4, I think it's, I mean, it will change for the mission, but I think other than that, it's also just a natural day-night cycle. But, uh, really? I got Notor- Fuck off, game. <laughs> Alright, so we are now- Oh, we gotta climb. Okay. I thought we were going back to his workshop. Alright, I suppose we can do this real quick then. It's time. You did it. It's beautiful. See. Now let's hope your idea works. 
because we're nearly out of time. Listen close, Ezio. You're going to want to fly from fire to fire. The heat of each one you pass over should lift you back up in the air again. Bene. Careful, though. There's archers out on the roofs tonight. Avoid those arrows, or it will be a short trip. I wish there was some way I could use my sword while flying these things. <laughs> well, you do have your feet free. If you get close enough without taking an arrow in the head, maybe you could kick them off the building. Nice. It's now or never, amico mio. Infrequent flyer. Pilot Leonardo's flying machine to the Palazzo di Cale. Once inside, assassinate Carlo Grimaldi. Makose! Shoot! Shoot a flying demon! <laughs> Whee! Okay, this is more than a dozen fires, I think. Oh, I flew over that one. I mean, I feel like they're a. Oh, they're using fire arrows! Ow. Okay, well that changes the calculus a bit. There we go. Although their aim is pretty shitty. What? Go up. He wasn't he wasn't pitching up for some reason. Oh, that was stupid. Oh well. Let's try this again. Whee. Shoot! Shoot a flying demon! Alright, let's take the uh, left path this time. Whee. Uh, I, is that E? Oh, okay, I guess it is E. Aha. Uh, where's the next fire? Probably down here. Okay. Ooh. No, what? I was holding A the entire time, and he, uh, he kept pivoting to the right, even though I was steering left. So I don't know if there's, like, if going over the flame centers you, maybe? Or it tries to force center you, but he was not turning the way I was telling him. Shoot! Shoot the flying demon! Alright. Yeah, like right now it's controlling fine, so I don't know what causes it to uh, not control fine. Uh, like right now I'm telling him to pitch down. It is, uh, I, I suppose part of it it's my fault. I'm expecting it to, really. <laughs> I'm expecting this to control almost like a, a glider or plane. And, uh, I mean, I guess technically it is a glider. But, um, I, I guess I'm expecting it to control more like a... A plane in fighter's anthology about thrust. Or is uh, that is certainly not how it controls. So I guess props to them. The physics are probably more on point than I give it credit for. Uh, actually. There we go. Whee! All right, so let's try this path. It seems to take us higher, so we have to deal with all the rooftop archers, but it does seem to uh, give us a little more... Uh-oh, we're going to go... How do we not take damage from that? Uh... All right. Uh... I need a fire... Okay, there's some ahead. That doesn't help me now. Here we go. 
There we go. There we go. God, we have 200 meters to go. Is it dawn already? Like, I thought we were doing this in the middle of the night. If we can just make that last fire up. Oh. Yeah, I think we're going to have to circle around and now uh, lift up. There we go. That should get us the rest of the way. What was that? Don't worry. Probably just kids with firecrackers. Come. It's your move. All right. I mean, he did detect me, but then I immediately killed him. Oh, well, this is fine. I'd like to uh, preserve my not jumping down status. Oh. Oh, God, there's so many of them. All right. There he is. Let's do this. And hi. I'm going to need you to be quiet, sir. Taking out all the rooftop archers should also make my escape easier, too. There we go. Stop! Signore, don't drink that! You are too late. The Doge is dead. What? Carlo? Apologies, Signore. But you should have listened to me when you had the chance. Seems you have failed, assassin. Forgive me, Signore. I tried. Why? What was it all for? Oh. Assassino! Assassino! He's killed the Doge! The Doge is dead! And so are you. It takes one assassin to kill another, it seems. We kill thinking it's best for us. Do we not, Messer Ezio? I do this not for myself. Compio questo sacrificio per il bene superiore. Requiescat in pace. You... You killed me? You killed me? Oh, let's, uh... What's up, you hasty gentlemen? All right, well, at least one of them has uh, good self-preservation instincts. What? I totally countered that. Oh, he didn't even have a weapon. I could have just assassinated him. All right, are we... Ow. There we go. Well, I suppose now we can just walk out the front door. Alright. Alright. 
All right, anyone else want to preserve their life? No, no one? Okay. I gave you all an out. Ow. At least it doesn't take health away when they counter you. That's very generous compared to the first game. There we go. And out of here. Okay, good. Some of them are choosing to live another day. All right. There we go. You can't catch me, na 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 na. All right, I'm just sick of. As much as I love fighting. There we go. Hi. I'm gonna need you to not reveal my hiding spot. All right, we should be good. We just need to get out of here now. Whee! Infrequent flyer, synchronized. And unless it's gonna, ooh, we got a codex page from the Scorp, so that's good. Are we teleporting? Memory sync sequence eight complete. All right. So I'm guessing this unlocks another part of Venice then. Okay, so at least we're staying in the simulation. Serenissimia Republica di Venezia, 1486. And I think that is a good place to end it for today. So with that, thank you all for watching and stay tuned for next time and stay safe out there and we'll see you then.